Okay, so you know, you know what's super fun? Super fun? <sighs> Heated gear is super fun for those of us that live in areas that are cold. I don't spend a lot of time outside in the winter. I'm going to be the first one to admit that. But uh, I do work or edit in a room over yonder um, in our house that is or can be quite chilly. Quite chilly. So I'm tr I keep looking over here because... For some reason, this is having issues. You've seen it in videos, right? I continuously am playing every day to try to figure out what's going on. So I keep looking over here. Anyways, um, I have issues with my feet being cold in that room. So uh, instead of having to crack the fire on all the time, which I can, um, these may come in handy right here. And these are smart heated socks. Oh yeah. Keep your winter warm. Enjoy sports. Well, I'm not enjoying sports. I'm going to say it as it is. But I, I do want to keep my feet warm. So we're going to crack open the box. Uh, see what comes with these. And uh, I'm going to try them on. Okay. Socks. Everybody loves socks. And everybody loves socks this time of year. I guess. Uh, in the summer, you may not need heated socks, but here in Canada, where I live, heated socks are going to be super awesome. So, what do we get? App first. <laughs> so, I've had heated socks before, but I'll be honest with you. Uh, you know, the issue is, is if you're just wearing them around the house, it's fine. But you, if you are someone that like puts them in boots, or for me, I would wear them when I'm like motorcycle riding or something. And then, of course, you, you can't necessarily get to the button to turn them on or off or change the heat or whatever it is. App, app enabled, yeah. Uh, app intelligent temperature control system, timing function, and real time power display function. 3D loop heated stocking. Not sure what that means, but it's cool that it has it, I guess. Invisible heating wire design. Nice. Uh, maintain long working hours and keep feet warm. I want warm feet. I want warm feet. All right. I'm going to get warm feet. I feel it. Ready? So, you oh, you do get a thank you for taking the time to browse and select our products. That's nice paper. Isn't that weird to say? But it is nice paper. Matt, Matt Keo, Matt Keo brand. Yeah, there you go. You can contact them if you want. Feel like it. Go ahead. Contact them. Uh, this is the user guide, smart heated socks from Matt Kao. Uh, security, packing details. Uh, there's a lovely manual though. I'm going to say it's a lovely manual. Oh, so there's, there is a QR code. Yes, QR code. So what we're going to do is we're going to scan the QR code because I think that's important so that we can get the app downloading and download on the app store just so you guys can see what the app is. Q Thermo. Yep, Q Thermo. That's coming down right now. Voila. All right, we'll let that just go. Um, all right, we'll figure this out as we go along. Socks. This would be as the socks. This, these, oh, these are fairly hefty batteries. Check these out. And that's a static bag. Static, static bag. See, I, I think it's gone. There it is. Static bag. All right. Anyways. Here's the batteries. Now they do have a curve on them, which is kind of nice. And I'm guessing that's so that when they're around your leg, you know. Okay, cool batteries. You get, I'm guessing this is a sock bag. That's a sock bag. Sock bag, I guess. Uh, and a charger. And it's nice too, because it is a charge with two and they are USB-C, which is excellent. Which also means, not that you necessarily would, but you could put bigger batteries in them. Uh, not as if you're gonna put huge batteries here, just, just because, you know, they're up against your legs, right? So you don't want a big like 20,000 milliamp battery sitting there. Uh, I don't even know what size that is. I'll put that up close if you guys can read that. Fantastic. Just kind of turn it, maybe you can read it. I have no idea. Pause it there, do whatever you need to do. Anyways, um, I am going to just, I'm going to put these on the charger just for a minute because we want to make sure that we have some power. Right now, they're sitting at about 50% out of the package and we'll just let them go. Okay, anyways, here is, here is the uh, 
here is the the socks and they do come in different sizes again i'll put links down below to where you guys can look at these oh yeah so see that would be you, you necessarily you could use this bag or you could use this one because it's got a pink zipper on it or you could use this either way it's all good Stop, look at those socks oh those are thick you see how thick those are check that out oh yeah your your feet would with just these socks alone are going to be toasty 100 percent. and there's the little sock pocket sock pocket sock pocket right there sock pocket with a little now what you could do if you really felt like it i guess because it's just a standard right usb-c charger Who's to say that you couldn't get maybe this a long USB-C like extension cable, run it up your pants into your pocket where you have a 20,000 milliamp battery. Now you're rock and rolling. You got cables up your pants. Things are working. Maybe that's awesome. I don't know. I'm just saying that's an option, right? Okay. So, so let's, let's, let's figure this out. So this, this here now. This here now says Q heat thermo would like to use Bluetooth. Yeah, left and right socks. Nothing's there though. Okay, these got enough charge to them. I'm thinking enough charge. We're not gonna put them in the pocket. We're just gonna stick them here. We're gonna turn this one around. Stick that one there as well. Where are we here? Yes, you guys can see the mess I'm making. Yep. And, okay. Okay, unplug you. You're going in here. I am beyond excited for these. <laughs> because, I, again, I don't like the cold. So, I guess we would turn the socks on. Yes, turn the socks on. My guess is, with some kind of magic, you would Bluetooth these, maybe. On, off, on. Okay, socks. Hit the settings. Find new. Oh, it's see. Find new. Refresh. Yes. Click. Confirm connection. Yes. Oh, you saw the light? Other one. Confirm co connection. Yes. Flashy, flashy. We're connected. That was easy. App update. Current version is the latest. I'm with you. Uh, there is a user manual right on here, if that's important. Maintenance. Okay, sock washing precautions. I'm down with you. Okie dokie. Uh, and then we're going to close this. And are you ready? So right and left, can I adjust these? Boom! 131. You can actually kind of adjust. Right, exactly how warm they're going to be. All the way up to 150 degrees. 158 degrees. And then you can set a timer at the bottom. So all the way up to 120 minutes. So let's say I only wanted them on for 20 minutes, because after that, I'm like, no, nope, I'll be passed out fast asleep, right? Good, 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 my sock. And they do have other things too, like depending on what kind of clothing it is. Okay, hold on. These, these are going in here, and I'm sockless right now. Yep, sockless. These are going in here. These, these may be, because in the spring, also in the spring, I like to ride. And I have to say, my feet do get cold in the spring, without question. Okay. Okay, socks. Oh, this bag is still sticking to me. Ready? Socks. Is there a right and a left? There is a right and a left, just so you guys know. These are, these are big socks. Ready? You guys see that? Dry skin. My goodness. Ready? I'm just going to do one for now. One for now. I think this is the right side because... It puts, ready? It puts this on the outside, right? Which is where you think it should be. And then you tuck that down. And even if you're wearing motorcycle boots, then you just, you just, you just come in here and be like, crank her up. Fahrenheit, Celsius, 70 degrees, what? And you can see my timer is going right and left. I just want to put my hand in here because I'm, I'm curious where the heat is. So the heat, the heat is right in your toes. 
that's where it is. It's right in your toes. So I got these down. Yeah, you can feel it. And even when it's at like 70 degrees, it's not, it's not like crazy hot, but I do think it wouldn't, it's just, it makes it big enough difference, right? You see, you see my foot, you know, that's a thumbnail, I think right there somehow. See now it just says, I see your eyes. It just doesn't, now that I want it to see my foot, how weird is that? You know? Okay. Anyways, I think when riding, that would be nice because, um, and it's not, uh, it's not like ridiculously like warm, but it's warm and that's the key. It's, it's warm. And I do like the fact that it doesn't, it really doesn't feel, uh, it doesn't feel like there's anything in your socks. Oh, there's that plastic. What is happening? All right, ready thumbnail? Can it, can it happen? Maybe, somehow? Yes, sir, thumbnail, right there. Okay, I'm gonna wear these for the next little while and see what's going on. And you can see, right, down to 16 minutes. All right, I'll be back. So I've been outside for the last probably half hour, 45 minutes, 45 minutes, 45 minutes for sure. And I am still rocking, rocking, rocking these. Oh yeah, rocking these. And I went outside wearing sandals and it's uh, currently minus eight outside. So here, here's the thing, here's the thing. I put them on downstairs, you guys saw me do that. And I was like, another, I can tell that there's warmth, but it's not like hot by any means. Now my feet were cold to start because um, like I said, I work in this room up here. It's not overly warm in this room, which is why you usually see me in a hoodie up here, especially during the fall, winter, spring months. Um, so I think the issue was, is that I could feel it, like, especially if I put my hands around my toes and felt them, I was like, oh, I can feel the heat, but it wasn't like prominent. But after a half hour slash 45 minutes, right now, I'm pretty sure my feet are sweating. Uh, they were plenty warm outside. Again, minus eight, we're in sandals. And uh, I just think it took some time for them to warm up. Now I got them fully cranked right up, which is, which is good. Um, but yeah, they're, they're toasty warm, toasty warm right now. Now, again, it's just, it kind of just wraps in around your toes, right? So if you're someone that's like, no, my, my whole foot gets cold. I don't know who, who's whole foot, but normally it's the toes, right? The extremities. Um, if you're someone who's like, my ankles get really cold. Well, then they're thick socks. That's going to be helpful. I guess they're thick socks. Um, but yeah, they're nice. They're nice. <laughs> Super. I'm going to have to take them off because... Or I guess I could just turn them down, turn them down. And it's nice too, cause like, I don't, I don't have, you can see, right? I don't have the app opened, but if I just kind of come in here and be like tap, they, it pops up like really fast. And at that point in time, I can just be like off, off. And I would think, I would think, yeah, the light's not on, right? Light's not on. And then for whatever reason, I was like, no, I need them on. Cause I need boom on. Yeah. And then of course I could just be like, crank them up, right? So just crank them up all the way up. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Just realize for one, if you stick cold feet in there, it may take a while for you to notice that there's heat, um, but they'll get there. The other thing I tried, I, I put them on with my motorcycle boots because I was curious if where the battery sat now, if you have high boots, of course, that may be an issue. But for me, I, I don't. They're just, they just come up over the ankle. Win, win, win. All right, guys, I'm going to put links to these below. These are probably the best heated socks I've tried. I've tried. Um, and that's it. Links down below. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit the little notification bell. And uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Later. Sweaty feet. Oh, no.